Howdy cowdies. Weekly walk about time with the collector. I hope you're going good. Not that I care. We've got some more nice stuff in the auction room. Been busy. Some nice silver jewellery over the back. Silver sugar tongs. Little carved bone Indian deities. This is a nice eastern silver uh, bowl. Really nice bit. A little plated Chatelaine notepad. We've got some really nice QSL cards. These are all radio sort of call sign cards, amateur radio stuff. This is a cool little lot here, mainly Australian ones, including the one on top's Geelong Radio Club, dated November 1927. These are all interesting sort of German and Russian ones, some in there from World War II. <coughs> Australian ones. These are more sort of interesting ones. There are AAF from Burma and stuff like that. And Vic Rail, Amateur Radio Society, and some other cards in there. And this is another interesting lot. There's heaps of Russian stuff and cool ones in there. There's about sort of 10 or 15 bundles of them this week, guys. Cool things. What else have we got? Nice big sort of glazed bookcase. A little watercolour of a couple of birds. I've put it with this big sort of gilt frame. The picture inside is just a print. Nice little Art Deco Diana lamp. She's lovely. It's pretty cool. Arctic Monkeys gig poster there. They played at the Palace. Signed by the designing artist in the bottom right-hand corner. A nice little sort of Edwardian-styled 1980s desk. Twin pedestal. And this is cool. Album poster for Mill and Colin. Signed by the band there. Cool thing. Nice little sort of 1970s bookshelf. Big cutlery drawers with all the stuff inside. Ladies' accessories. Nice box of pretty china and stuff. Some stationery and gear. All metalware, Art Nouveau, copper and brass. There's a couple of nice sad irons in amongst there as well. We'll mix a lot of Victorian, China and Dalton and sort of Tremar English art pottery and stuff. Cool ladies' clothing, some fairy slippers down the bottom and some other bits in that lot. Uh, records and sort of audio gear. Some more ladies' clothing, all sort of 1960s stuff. Big lot of fishing tackle and fishing rods. More fluffy slippers. Postcards, this is all sheet music and ephemera. Some cool covers and stuff in amongst. Big group lot, four boxes of sort of mixed ceramics and other stuff. Some guitars. With a flying V. Board games, cool vintage men's clothes, as new can't tear them pants. These are cool car keys, sort of 1945, I think they're dated. A uh, little mixed lot of china and ceramics and stuff. Mentos and other point of sale signs. This is all piercing stuff, little stainless steel bars and stuff to go through your bloody lips and your bloody who knows where. Uh, Pubinalia, big lot of pictures with some china. Uh, boxes of royalty books. These are all novelty money boxes. This we've got audio gear. Uh, bike stuff with some roller skate gear. Toys with a couple of globes. Big railway light. There you go. Got a red lens or something inside it there. Big surround to go with it. We've got a few of these in the sale. Box of kids' toys and stuff. F heaps of footy gear. APNS. More toys. This is a cool little lot of all the sort of point of sale milk bar. Little sort of cards for mint chews and hokey pokies and cool old sort of cordial and soft drink labels. Uh, nice lot of old postcards. The shop bell, good lot of stamps, some pretty early, mainly sort of 19th century stuff. Another nice little lot of ephemera. Uh, costume jewellery, some Egyptian things. All signed sporting sort of paper, ephemera cards, footballers. Uh, mix lots of stuff down under the table. Nice big sort of modern dressing table with the mirror that lifts off. Big lot of pictures, paintings, prints, golf clubs. A little bit of Franco Cozzo action, huh? Whole table with the mirror to go over the back. This we've got big decorative painting of Paris. More sort of train lights. It's a cool big lot of sort of cooking stuff and things. Nice old coffee grinder. Uh, what else? Some metalware. I kind of like that old sort of brass arts and crafts vase with some other bits. Cool big suitcase. I don't think you're going to miss that at the airport, are you? A billy cart and an exit sign, so you can at least you can, you know, find your way out in style. 
big box of AP. There's all Australian military books, As You Were, Stand Easy, Jungle Warfare. Another big railway light. There's a cooler 1970s Hanamex uh, headphones. Little mix lots of stuff, all sort of vintage men's shirts, dicky collars and stuff like that. Nice old pictures and paintings and prints. There's a big train sign with the surround, the little uh, visor and the big unit. It's a umbrella heater. Another big railway light with the three bits. And this thing's way cool. It's like a fire screen with, with a two bar heater in it. Real 1950s. It's in great nick. Occasional furniture. And else we've got some weights. Pretty china. Camera gear. Ladies accessories. Royalty stuff. A couple of nice old books. We've got some lovely old books in the sale. Gaming stuff. It's a shame that the little bloody joystick things come off here. The old Galaxy Invader game. Some more good quality books, sort of military related, royalty stuff, motoring gear, kids sort of books and games, Louis Vuitton, good little Sony amplifier, small stereo gear down the back here, some nice planet lamps, big lot of sort of baseball gear, cricket pads. What else have we got? A couple of nice paintings, this little... Pastel watercolour, about 1910 or something. I think it's Bond. Yep, J.A. Bond or something like that. The Walk Home. Really nice with that willow tree in the background. Nice big Malcolm War colour screen print. And this is a ripper. We sold one of these not too long ago. Big Alan Cowan oil painting. Big busy street scene. I really like it. Cool thing. Dalton China. Really nice as new John Barling saucepan set. Couple of more nice ladies bags. Crocodile Dundee's hat. It's like a 10 gallon hat or something. Good little crystal and, and glass. Cool little group lot of sort of mixed blokey sort of books and ephemera. Some QSL radio cards. Photography film stuff. Dalton. More QSL cards. More bags. This is cool. Little sort of retro clock radio with a little lamp on top. It all folds up. A little bit discoloured, which is a shame. Uh, some old sort of cinema cups. Bit of Ninjago action. More QSL cards. Nice clock. Husker Do, double LP over the back. Pluck it up with his helmet. Because you know what bloody Dell used to do to him. More QSL cards. European China. Um, as new night sport indoor cricket balls. Mickey Mouse stuff. A couple of pairs of brand, pretty much brand new vans. Oriental, Pubinalia, there you go, the dandy portable ironer, how'd you be getting your fingers in there, eh, a bit like on Prisoner, <laughs> cool retro colourful umbrellas, restrike set of three triptych restrike engravings, banker's lamp, Oz pottery, some big electrical, what is it, specific earth resistance tester, there you go, sounds like I know what I'm doing. Crystalline stuff, nice little, uh, I think it's German etching, grappling hook and a truncheon, Oz pottery, some cool old lobby cards, small ladies' bags, a little mix lot with the old fashioned whorehound squares. Ease your throat. <laughs> a couple of nice little bits of glass and a nice little Japanese lacquerware, a little European etching. This one might be Japanese, I'm not sure. Maybe not, just a little bit interesting. Oriental, pink coloured glassware, some 70s gear, Susie Cooper. What else? Big lot of postcards, correspondence, some interesting stuff in amongst. Um, the Ronson Can Do, Kitchen Magician. Can open a mix of whisk, knife, shop, and a potato masher wall rack. Everything in one, brand spanker. Um, some news, uh, news agent headline posters, some cool games, Bermuda Triangle, and other stuff, easy built. More nice ephemera. Kids' toys and ephemera. Some cool old sort of cinema cups. Ghostbusters, Return of the Jedi, Rambo. I think this is a soil testing kit. Um, postcards and sort of badges and stuff. English China. These are cool. 1983 7-Eleven Slurpee cups. Pac-Man, Cubit. Moon Patrol. Burger time. Moon Patrol was a fantastic game. Noritake. QSL, English. 
cool little lot of sort of little toothpick holders and stuff. Viewmaster and some slides. Bit of Guns and Roses, User Illusion 2, good album. Cool lot of retro sort of kitchen alia. And some other little English bits off the corner. And so we've got some more nice old books. Another lady's bag. Worcester. Cool old bear. Aerosmith album over the back, original. I think it's an Australian pressing. More butterflies, more QSL cards. Saplatypus, nice little book by Charles Barrett, which is signed by him on the inside. Art Glass, Collingwood Football Club Players album from 1970, which is signed by Peter McKenna. Some more cool QSL cards. Art Glass, Guns N' Roses again. More QSL cards, cool with the Qantas jetliner on it, the V-Jet. Ladies Bag, Grand Funk album with the original 3D glasses still in the cover. Another big lot of QSL cards, nice bits of Italian glass, a little buggle, more nice bits of glass, I think that's Royal Ducks, Fowler, Motley Crue album, once again Australian pressing I think, original bit from like 88 or 89. Nice little Barsoni style lamp, but she has been fixed back up, it looks like, around her head and her arms. These are a lovely pair of Italian miniatures, hand-painted, they're both signed. The artist and her muse. <laughs> Lifesavers point of sale, things a ripper. Nice big heavily embossed brass uh, cupids. Lovely old sort of empire style clock. QSL cards, Ainsley. GNR Lies, great album. Nice little three-piece original clock garniture set. Metallica, Justice For All. Another pretty cool album. These are all Australian pressings. And a nice bit of glass. Little deco, sort of heavy brass. Little diver. Couple of nice bits of remude over the back. Mickey and Donald. Uh, another nice little sort of miniature profile. Couple of nice lady head vases. These are nice. The Japanese uh, Shibayama panels. All right, Royal Delft. I think Vanessa was excited. She did a bit of research and found out all about it. More QSL cards. AMB Boyd and Martin Boyd Ramekins. We've got some nice stuff up the top shelf. Paris Art. Lovely Barsoni lamp with the original shade. She's nice. Little Greek bronze figure of Aphrodite. It's got a little label on the base. And she's nice. Little Japanese bronze there as well of a little dancing African girl. Another nice bit of glass, James McMurtry, James McIntyre, something like that. Shibayama panel over the back's lovely. Bendigo Frog. Metallica Master of Puppets, which I think is a UK pressing. This is a great bit, little Fowler. Uh, Fowler. No, it's not Fowler, Falconware. Cool little jug with all the spookies and stuff on it. It's got the text on the back, ghoulies and ghosties and long-legged beasties and things that go bump in the night. Good Lord, deliver us. Really cool thing. It's in great condition. Oh, the guys on the front are fantastic. Uh, a couple of lovely big bits of Tunstall. Well, that's the bloody biggest bit I've seen for ages. A little bit of Worcester. Nice little Baramba. Australian pottery vase, which is really nice. There you go, guys. That'll do. Hopefully you saw something you liked. I don't really care if you did or if you didn't. <laughs> we'll see you on Thursday night. It'll be another good sale.